now welcome back to one of my videos I'm gonna take you on a little adventure up here to the witch's tree it's Halloween tonight so I want to show you how they make the witch's broom but I have to take you up to the witch's tree just a little bit further and we have to keep quiet we don't want to upset or disturb the witch that's us here isn't this a wonderful sight beautiful tree isn't it but it's completely different it transforms to dark shortly see what I mean as soon as you step under it it changes colour, it goes darker, isn't that amazing? It's like all the colour drains from everything as soon as you're under this circumference of the tree. It's a different world once you're underneath the witch's tree. Now, shh, need to keep quiet. Those are the branches that make up the broomsticks. Now, inside there is where all the little creatures, birds and animals, take refuge. And amongst all those broomsticks, branches, and I think myself, they get a little bit of protection in there from the witch. The witch looks after them. Nobody harms them when the witch is about. These branches are what makes up the broomstick. These are called the brooms. And the witch's tree is surrounded by them. There's enough branches here to make thousands of broomsticks she won't run low anyway as you can see it's a particular shape and it's full of brooms uh oh what's that I hear I think we've disturbed the witch listen There she is, she's flying above Leafy's Wood with the autumn trees. Isn't that a spectacular sight? Lovely. She was flying pretty high, wasn't she? And she also had her little black cat. I wonder if we'll see her again. You never know, we might. That was a privilege to see that. Is that her? I thought that was her there. I thought I got a glimpse of her again. I think she's flew off towards the town. This is one of her busiest nights, you see, Halloween. So she's away doing her stuff. Now, put me in the mood to watch some Halloween films tonight and just saying that's one of my favourite films, is the Halloween series. Yes, a little bit gory and horror, but the old classics are the best. I also like to watch some of the animated Halloween films. There's some beautiful Disney cartoons and animations that they've made, so... Yes, I'm going off home shortly to have my beef olives for my lunch, my dinner, and sit down and watch some Halloween films. So, it'll be meatballs and 
beef olives for lunch tonight. Yummy, yummy. Anyway, I hope you have enjoyed this different vlog and catch you in the next one. A bit less scary maybe. Now, where is that witch? Where is she? Mm-hmm.